Welcome back to Andres Arre, where today we are going to be watching Breaking Bad Season 3, Episode 8, titled, I See You, I, I See You. It was just I See You once. So, in the last episode, it was insane. I got rid of all of my hand sanitizer because Hank got shot. And he didn't get just shot once. Like, that man got shot, like, a couple of times. Like, tw and I, it looked like he got he got shot once when he was in the car on his arm. Then he got shot, it looked like, in his chest twice. Um, the twins ended up dying, which I thought the twins were definitely going to stick around for the least, at least the rest of this season. Um, now, my question is, some uh, uh, somebody said in the comments on the last episode that something about the, the time said, on Jesse's phone, it said 320, and then on Hank's phone, it said 320, I think they said. Um, I don't even know what that means, but they said everything is done for a reason on Breaking Bad, so I'm going to try to look out for things like that more often and find out what the reason is for this 320 situation. Um, who called Hank? The only person that would have known that the twins were coming to get Hank is Gus, because Gus is the one who told them about Hank. So, um, Walt wouldn't know, Jesse wouldn't know, um, like, it doesn't seem like anybody else would have known but Gus, but why would Gus do that? He could have had, maybe Gus wanted the twins to be killed so that they would be out of his hair because they kept bothering him because they really wanted to attack Walt. Maybe that's why he did it. I don't know. But what the heck is now going to happen? Because once word gets around that the twins are dead, I can't even imagine. Weren't they in the cartel as well? And what is Teal going to do? Because Teal, like, obviously raised them. So there's so many questions with that. Also, Hank also was suspended. Uh, from his job because he beat up Jesse. Jesse and Walt are now partners in crime. So that is good. I kind of had a feeling that they were going to be because Jesse and Walt are both main characters and that's th th their whole situation was them going to cook for money. So obviously they were gonna, going to be reconnected. I just didn't know how. Um, so in this episode, I'm really hoping that I would get a lot more Skylar <laughs> Everybody knows that I love me some Skylar. Every time she's on the scene, I am laughing my ass off. I love me Skylar. And her interaction with Walt would be amazing. I'm still hoping that Skylar and Saul meet one day because if they do, I mean, now now it's gonna, it could be possible that Sky, Sky and Saul would meet because Sky knows about what uh, Walt does. Yeah. And also, I wonder if Sky is going to look more in depth because she did ask Walt about uh, helping to get Jesse to, to not press charges on Hank. And now Jesse's not pressing charges on Hank to, from being assaulted. And now Jesse's working with Walt. So I wonder if Sky is going to put this all together and be like, yeah, yeah, I thought so. I wonder if she's going to push any more levels because... Um, Walt doesn't, Walt seems like he doesn't care anymore. He's like, girl, Walt, Walt, um, Hank used to be part of my family. He's no longer part of my family. When he said that to her, I was like this. <gasps> I was clutching pearls I did not have. It was a really, like, Walt doing a 360, Jesse's doing a 360, and Skylar is still Skylar, but she seemed like she's about to start playing ball. And I love, well, she was when she was sleeping with her boss, so... She's in the game. Um, I'm really, really excited for this episode. So, without further ado, let's jump into Breaking Bad, Season 3, Episode 8, and find out what it has got to give. Boop. Oh, also, Jesse's in the hospital, and now Hank is going to be in the hospital. Karma. <laughs> mm, Jesse, you are so skinny. Super skinny. Jesse's leaving the hospital. That was quick. Good job, Jesse. I wonder if you'll see Hank. Look at his eye. He needs to get a patch. That'd be amazing if he sees uh, Hank. You'd be okay waiting here by yourself? What? Yeah, whatever. 
you'd like to smoke, you need to be another 20 feet from the door. Ah, well, Roll push me him. further, bitch. <laughs> I love when he says that. Oh my God. Is this Hank? Ew, Jesse is so nosy. Well, it's Hank. He's gonna see Hank. <laughs> oh my BP God, 70, how weird. 70, over Pulse 140. Look at Jesse, so nosy. No sounds on the right side. Ooh. Four. Shoulder and hip through and through, right lung and lower left quadrant. No visible exit wounds. Yep. Ah, Jesse is going Six for? units of nag type and cross for six more units. Notify the OR. We are on the way. Oh, he could walk because he doesn't have his wheelchair. <laughs> Bet you Jesse thinks it's like somebody's looking out for him. Yeah, karma. Who's picking him up? Oh God, this guy. Damn, brother, look at you. How you feeling, you okay? Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm great. Look at that. He needed that, child. Jesse said, I'm great. How are you? <laughs> I'm so ghetto. I thought things were going pretty well. I, I thought we were kind of simpatico. What? You know? Yeah, well. Not so much, no. Is this uh -huh. about the temperature setting the other day? Because I can assure you that will not happen. No, it's bigger than that. Yeah, it's not you, it's him. Necessarily benefit from a prolonged, you know, yeah, so. I set up the entire lab. You said you liked the configuration. And I do. Yep. That, that we just have different rhythms, Gail. He's a liar, Gail. But you are, are more. Jazz. 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 There's nothing wrong with jazz. It's <laughs> simply. Oh, Lord. Fire. Classical. Look, you get it. Man, this is the ball. Oh, God. He should have said he was rock. <laughs> What's up, partner? I can't believe this. This is my replacement. Oh, Jesus. Hi. <laughs> Oh, damn, damn, I should have ditched that RV months ago. It's all like shiny up in here. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! This. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, dear mother of God. I feel bad for Gail. This is for the best. 200 pounds a week. Got it? Yeah. This man is so not caring about anything. I don't know why he even tried. Mm -hmm. There's a lot to show you. Walt Some looks like he does not want him there. We've only got a couple days before our next batch is due. I need to get you up to speed. I don't know why they couldn't have three. Oh, less money. There's a cell service down here. It's non-existent. We're shielded. You don't know. Why? Ooh. Brother-in-law. What about him? Oh, wow. Two Pulse units of uh, normal saline. We've got a bag about mass. Bilateral large. And it's kind of Walt's fault because they were looking for Walt. Soft, soft. See if you get a pulse. <laughs> what is that? Oh, that's the um, that's the one twin. Oh, that's sir, probably the twin who got you? hit by the car. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, he's family. I'm so sorry. Oh, look, there's Skyler. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I don't know what to say. I'm behind it all. I don't know. They won't really tell us anything. He's still in surgery. He shot him four times. Oh. Oh Christ. Where's Holly? I gotta sit her. Oh. Fine. Yeah. Why is he so angry? Oh God. I know I'm why he's fine. angry. I just need some fresh air. Here, let me get the door. I got it. Oh. Hex brother-in-law, Walt. I'm very sorry. Mm, they... Any details? Right now, all we know is two men ambushed Hank, probably Mexican nationals. Their tattoos indicated an affiliation with a drug cartel. Oh. Why, why did they attack Hank? We're not sure yet. In addition to an investigation that Hank was working on. Oh. They had an axe. The axe. Cartels tend to be dramatic. In front of your damn house. Where are they? I mean, did they? Hank got both of them. The other one's upstairs in critical condition. Considering he didn't even have his gun. Yep. He didn't have his gun. Do they not know? He's suspended. Marie 
the assault charge. I had to suspend Hank pending the investigation. Oh. Okay, okay. All right, listen. This. If you would have all him right from the start and let him arrest that little degenerate, and he uh -oh. would have had a gun and could have defended himself. Oh, Marie. Go ahead, girl. It's, he didn't it's his fault. have a gun. Honey, this isn't helping you. You. Oh. You were supposed to back him up, and where were you? He took the job. At Texas. Yeah. Yeah. You're oh, supposed God. to protect your agents taking their guns, not supporting them Marie, when they're- Marie. 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 I'm not doing anything until these two get the hell out of here. Uh, sorry. Go. Oh. I'm not welcome here. The DEA is not welcome here. Oh, Marie. Okay, girl, I know you're upset, so I'm going to let you calm down. Walt has some guilty conscience. It's just them. What? It's you, Walt. What? Oh, is Pinkman Hank was looking for? He would have never even heard his name if you hadn't bought marijuana from him. Marie, you actually told him to call. Think about everything that you have put him through. Marie, stop. Marie's just lashing. I want to blame, and it's understandable, but don't blame Walt. It's not his fault. Mm. Wow. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sweet. Right there, Skyler. Stuck up for uh, Walt. It's Hank. And it's all Walt. Hugging, hugging the wrong person. Are, are they all trying to get blood to help Hank? Mm. He's gonna be behind on his, uh, making his doses. They did shoot him four times. Damn! I love Walt. <laughs> Actually, I don't like Walt, actually. Uh-uh. Is he gonna fix the damn table? <laughs> like, we're not doing this today. I can't. Hello, hello, hello. Oh my God, Jesse, you're going backwards. Ah. Uh. Yo, yo, yo! What is wrong with this man? Oh my god, I hate loud people. And I am so loud. <laughs> oh. So, he's not doing anything at all to help. He's just there. Walter White, please pick up a courtesy phone. <laughs> How do they know who called you at the hospital? Look at Skyler. Yo, we working sometime this year? I tried your cell and it went straight to voicemail. It's been a whole day. How long is this grieving process? Just put a clock on it for me. I can't. Dude, it's not my schedule. We have responsibilities here. I'll get there when I get there. I'm just cook on my own. You will do no such thing. Why not? Ooh. There's gotta be some sort of manual. Oh my God. I'm not your bitch to order around. We're partners, remember? Oh. Uh. And wait, I will be there as soon as I can. We really do appreciate that. What? Is your wife there? <laughs> hey, tell your douchebag brother-in-law to head towards the light. Oh. Maybe we should go get everybody some breakfast. Yeah, that sounds good. Okay. Uh, do you know who that was? Go ahead, lie to her. <laughs> I love Skylar. <laughs> go ahead, tell me who it was. <laughs> This, these spots, this <laughs> fork is absolutely filthy. Those are just water spots. That's fine. <sighs> so not water spots. It's oh. dirt covered in germs from someone else's mouth. Oh, God. Ours at home aren't any better. Yours at home are irrelevant. We are in a hospital. I'm not actually sure if the cafeteria necessarily qualifies oh, as God. being part of the hospital. Thank <laughs> God, are you supposed to survive this death trap? Marie is gone. She, she's going through it this episode. I survived. Remember how scared we all were? I didn't want to act like it, but I was terrified. Mm. How they were actually going to cut me open. Well, I, I couldn't get that image out of my head. They took me into pre-op, waiting for them to anesthetize you, knowing that you may never wake up Oh my God, Walt. This isn't happening. Huh. Actually, what I really remember about that day. Oh God, he's not done. 
Skylar, you remember me wanting to drive that day? Why is she crying? Oh my God. And we hit every green light. They're reminiscing. Bang, green the entire way. Why today can't I just spend a few extra minutes in the car with my family? Oh, Skylar's crying again. At least I was with my family. I had that. I mean, the hospital food looks really bad. <laughs> and I'm not half the man your husband is. <laughs> That was a good uh, story.